everyone and today I'm going to show you how to build a Lithin Python script to download all the images from any website or web page using a very simple method and we'll use the beautiful soup 4 library for this task so it is not pre-installed it is a third mod party module used to scrape websites so we'll install it using command prompt so cmd and then to install it just run the command install beautiful so for this will install it it will take a while all right once you have it just go to python idle and then we have to import the libraries first so we can import requests and we'll say import ps4 as ps and after that we import urllib.request so we'll say urllib.request this will import all the libraries and we have to get the url from the user so it's a url equal import url equals string input and the input is url and after that we have to close it and we have to build the opener after this to to override the user agent so that the website or the web page assumes that we are visiting the website from a browser but we are not doing that so it is just faking it so we have to build the opener so we'll say opener equals url dot request dot build opener and build opener after that we have to add the headers which will the user agent so we'll say opener dot add headers equals in the brackets we will say user agent and our agent is mozilla let us do that and then we have to install the opener so we'll say url dot dot install open sorry open. and the opener we want to install it is open once we have that we have now we have to go to the website so we will say raw this will store the raw html so requests get and this will get the url and then get it as text and after that we have to give it to html.parser so that we can parse it and then scrape it so we'll say soup equals bs.bu beautiful soap raw and then html dot parser you can also use lxml it is better so to install the lxml you have to say pip install lxml but html dot parser will also work so we will use that and now we have to store the images image tags will get the images so we will say images equals dot find all this will find all the tags find all and all the tags we have to find is image tags Let's store the image in html if you don't know after that we have to create a links list which will store all the links of the images and we have to look through the images on the website so we will say for image in images <coughs> we 
link equals <coughs> and the link will be image dot cat sorry image dot cat we want to get the source attribute from the image since that stores the link of the image and we have to detect if the URL is in the image source because many times it is not in the source of the image so we won't be able to download it so we will say HTTP column slash slash not in link then we will plus concatenate it with link equals url plus the link <coughs> and if it is then we will just we will just append it to the link to the links list so we'll say append so we'll say links append link once we do that we have to print how many images we have detected so we print print images detected how many detected we don't know C plus length of the links that will be the number of images that have been detected links now we have to look through all the images in the links array uh, sorry list and then we have to download it so we will say for i range and range length of the links at list and after that we have to define the file name <coughs> so the file name equals let's just say image and then curly brackets and then dot png so why i have done the curly brackets because after that we will say format because in the format function we will give i so the first time this loops run the i is 0 and then the file name will be image 0.png the second time runs dial will be 1 and the image and the file name will be image 1.png so that will define a unique name to all the images and we will be good let's just download it so we will say url request URL retrieve and we want to retrieve the URL which is links R. and where we want to store it in the file name this will store it in the current working directory and when it is done we will print done Let's just run it. It is asking for the URL and we will give it HTTPS. We will give it the Google search page. So we'll say HTTP colon slash slash www.google.com. Here it should be string because we cannot concatenate string with integer. So we'll make it string. I just run it. See what happens. Again asking HTTP images detected one and then done. Let's just see if it has downloaded or not. And you can see here is the Google image that it has downloaded. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. We'll meet in the next video. Until then, bye.